And now for the fifth sub-level of the shower room. Hi, I'm Tiki. One my let's play Pick the Do. In the last part, we did the first part of the shower room. And this part, I'm going to do the second part. I need a rant topic. It's funny, they give you all these things to power up your army, but then they put enemy right by your bait. Go all the way. Ironic. Alright, that's the first thing we want to do because you flowered Pikmin, not happy Pikmin. The babies. Also, death. So, why don't I go off with Olimar and just figure out what the heck's going on here? Because I'm honestly a bit confused. Because this floor generates itself randomly. Now, this floor is very special. If you don't have 20 blue Pikmin, you're kind of out of luck here. Here in creative liquid. This requires eight. Now, because Solar Train Legitimate, it's likely you'll end up with one that's 20, so bring 20 blue picks in, just in case. Alright, I actually got lucky this time, but most of the time you won't get lucky. Which I guess if you do lose a Pikmin, you can always reset repeatedly until you actually allow that you lucky all the treasures. But that's cheating. It's so it's very just to come prepared anyway. It, you don't want it's annoying to reset until you get a good layout because you'll get all this good stuff and you can't keep any of it. So it's so sad. But let's hammer this guy with our purple purple hammer. Who you? There we go. So let's pull, let's pull our blue Pikmin to the line of action, and we'll get that treasure out. Now, there's actually a cool thing you can do here, which I will be showing off in an extra video. But what it is, is, I think that blue Pikmin can save Drawn and Pikmin. Well, if you have Pikmin drawing here, you try to get them out with your blue Pikmin. They can't throw them out. So they'll just keep in the wall, but we'll keep saving them over and over again. I will show this off in an extra video, because it is cool to watch. Anyways, oh, we have some more fire hazards. We can easily take this out with purple Pikmin, but you know what? Red Pikmin, they're we're getting a little bit of time to shine. Oh crap. Can we just stand there and guy didn't attack? Wow, your AI is stupid. Good job, Nintendo. You programmed Fat AI into a really good video game. Here we have, let's see, we got an orange ball warp, a fiery blowhog, fiery blowhog, and both treasures in the hole. And a wither in the blowhog. Okay, this is gonna be fun to deal with them. I guess one thing I can start out by doing is I can start out by killing all of these guys. So this will be helpful. It'd be nice not to worry about the orange ball board because they don't, they're not hard enemies. They're easy to take out, but they do get in the way if you're not careful. There we go. I want the wither and blow all of those. But this will make this a bit more manageable. Get rid of all these ball boards. There we go. All right. Let's get the purple Pikmin in here. Are we 
gonna start by taking um, the Wither and Blowhog. I just need to trick him into my range. Right from below there, where there's nothing, that works too. Come here, I got my juicy Alamar for you. I defar my pig for the rest of my own misery. You're not a human, you don't enjoy misery. I love her. Unless you're like overly evolved. Yeah, that's probably an answer in all of our shows, so I'll probably read it later. Well, that's that. And we get the princess here. into the water, I swear, I will keep them your grandchildren. Not really. Alright, so that's there. Alright, that's good. There we go. We got the broken food master and the endless repository. Neither thing you would find in a bathroom. And I would hope you wouldn't find that leaf from the last one in your bathroom. Thinking you might. Shower room, sub level six. All right, this floor, I remember this floor. This is actually a pretty important floor. Because it has something very helpful on it. It also has something very hurtful on it. I'm gonna try to find the helpful thing. Alright, let's explore for a minute. Let's see what we have over there. Why don't we start by on this wall? Well, right, we got an enemy. No, we don't. Or do we? Oh, it's one of those that spawn after you pick up the treasure. There we go. Hoping we can take out all the same people very easily. So there we go. We have Snapple! 1992. The Abstract Masterpiece. Why is that in your bathroom? Seriously. This is what they've asked me. There's so much stuff that's out of place in the bathroom. Hey. Alright, we got nothing over here. This is our next stop. Yeah, it makes perfect sense, right? But there actually isn't nothing over here. There's something very important over here. And if there isn't, well, I'll probably reset the game because this is very really important. But we want to get our purple pick ready. Because we got a hidden enemy here. And this enemy, it's very helpful. Look, it's the doodle bug. Now, 
this guy, you hit him, he gives you better sprays. But he's actually the only guy who can kill Pikmin because he does spark poison. So yep, yeah, it's Sierra and Glimp Beetle of the Bitter Sprays. Very helpful. But now what we're going to do is we're going to quickly double them. We're going to get these sprays. Alright, anyways. Now, let's break down this wall. Now, proceed with caution through here. So much caution, you don't know what to do with it all. Because there is a bomb in there. A bomb that'll try to blow up all your little children. Seed with all caution. See? Although you can use it to your advantage, man. Through here, we got an orange bulb over in the water. That's not nice. And the exit. All right. Now we can actually bring our army through. So let's start by bringing purple pictures in. Have we got bulb over the water? It's manageable. Don't get me wrong. It's not bad. But we here we have the bubbling snitch bug. It's just a it's just a regular snitch bug. Except it tries to plant your captain, which. It doesn't do the job. Alright, let's quickly bait this guy. Alright, let's be extra careful, and you're dead. That's not bad. Alright. Nope, we just have the behemoth jaw. Oh, enemy! There we go. And that's the behemoth jaw. Alright, let's get our blue pick. We have to go deal with the orange ball we're in the water. That's not right, okay? That's just not right. We're getting very close to clearing our debt. Now, if you haven't figured it out yet, there is post game to this. Which is 100% it's not actually clearing the debt. 100% is actually being all the treasures. There we go. Now I actually did get a bear spray on this floor. I'm going to try to not use it. I probably will have to. He's not, he's stuck out of the water. I can take him out of the process. You guys are probably screaming, just use a bitter spray. I 
like these things are, are not cheap to get. Why did you get oh goodness? Can I kill you? Can I kill you? Yeah, I can. Alright, now I can actually eat the treasure. Now they're all dead. We have and you remember, you can remember this guy from Citadel. We got the head, it was the Paradoxal Enigma. So, what do you think all about it, Skull? Anyways. So, how have you guys been? I've been doing good. There's not much to talk about. You know what? Magic of editing! It worked! We have the rubber ugly! Yep, that's honestly a mean joke. Oh well. That's it! Let's go! Now we get to go fight the boss. You guys are all probably wondering what this boss is. Well, I'll tell you what it is. It's going to be told in the next part. No, not really. I'm not going to cut you off there. Uh, I hate cliffhangers. I'm not going to leave you on one. I don't like long videos either, though. There we go. Now this boss, it's a doozy. It's quite an interesting creature. Okay, I'll just go on it. It's weird. Now I'm hoping I can get some spray, even though I won't really need them. This boss is not a hard boss. Can't go that way now. I can lock it over here. Ooh, go back to the opening here. Alright. Well, that's how I'll take my picture then. then. <laughs> We've already started the ball time, right? And we, we haven't even seen him yet. When this boss works is... This is the Raging Bloister, an upgraded version of the Toy Bloister. Now, this guy will follow your active captain. How you switch captains will be slightly confused. Now the way most of take out is he'll they'll have two parts of Pikmin. And they'll just keep switching out. I do I find the smart way. Which is you want you to just have one part of Pikmin, swap captains every time time he takes colors. And then get behind him with your purple, and that's it. This is a much easier and safer strategy, in my opinion, if you can master the time. But, yeah, we got a thing! Yay! Just absolutely sure. You don't just tell me anything to my home. Yeah, I think he's clean occasionally. It'd be nice if you didn't mouth, if you wouldn't mouth off occasionally. But I don't get that luxury. Why should you get the luxury of me doing my chores? Don't tell that to your parents. No, actually don't. I don't, I don't want my subscriber count to drop because you got murdered from bad advice. So. But now, let's go find the exit. Where is the exit? The exit's in there. Well, I'm going to, well, as I try to work this way back, I'm going to try to get the exit. But yeah, that was the shower room. Not a bad cab room, if I say so myself. But we got 
the Amplified Amplifier. This shape is well suited for amplification, an amplification of sound waves. A moment, please. I shall use this as the final part to my new sound equipment. The Mega Tweeter is done. Captain Olimar, this device has increased the acoustic range of your whistle and will allow you to tweet longer than 140 characters. Because Olimar loves his Twitter. There we go. Yeah, that's it. This project is over halfway over. Sad. These, these let's plays, they grow up so quickly. But, that is the end of the shower room. On, on our, my next upload, I will upload the end of the day, which isn't going to be a long video. You got two uploads today. I don't want any complaining. <laughs> but I will see you guys next time. Stay. Ooh, that's one, two, three, four, Pocos.